This is my 2022 Douglas Trailer Incorporated trailer. It's a 7x16. On the outside of the trailer, it looks like everything was built pretty nicely. It's basically just a standard trailer. Not special order at all. I did install the E-Track. But what the problem is, is none of the screws anywhere are actually screwed in straight or flush. The screws on the wall, it's as if whoever built this trailer did not have a laser level, did not have a chalk line. Every one of these screws is gonna have to come out and be reset before I can epoxy this floor. Every one of these screws on the floor, here's where they, they just flat out missed one. Here's another one. You can't epoxy over that. You have to pull those screws all the way out and redo them. None of the measurements from up here to here are correct all the way down at all. Light switch is broken when I got it. I called them, I emailed them about the quality of the build, the interior. No one replied. And I did speak with someone at the DTI office and she said, oh yeah, someone will get back to you and let you know what we can do about it. That was seven days ago. So apparently GTI or DTI does not care about the quality of their trailers and certainly not the happiness of their customers. Will the trailer work for its intended purpose? Yes, but the quality control is beyond reprehensible. It is atrocious. How hard is it to pop a line or use a laser level? These three screws appear to be lined correctly. They're the only screws on the inside of the trailer, and they're even the middle one is dropped by about three quarters of an inch. Like I said, it's as if they didn't have a level, a tape measure, or a laser.